Hi, this is Greg with Seven Lights Nutrition, and today I'm making this video on turmeric. I don't necessarily want to get into all of the benefits of turmeric. Um, I think those things are widely known already. The internet is uh, chock full of information about how beneficial turmeric is. Um, the active compound within turmeric is uh, curcumin or curcuminoids. And these things have an incredible benefit on so many different health issues. Uh, if you see this story here, 500 reasons why turmeric may be uh, the world's most important herb. That's just one article. You can go to greenmedinfo.com and pull that story up. Um, but here's what really uh, is interesting about turmeric. Um, it's a very difficult um, spice to actually make bioavailable inside the body. It doesn't digest easily, doesn't process easily, so a lot of people that are out there ingesting turmeric may be getting uh, little to no results from it due to the fact that their body's not absorbing it effectively. Um, what's really taken this to the next level is uh, something uh, inside of black pepper known as piperine. Uh, and this is incredible information that uh, needs to be shared and, and people with uh, interest in turmeric need to understand. All these stories here, there's three of them. These are all studies from the US NIH. So this isn't something that's just me saying it. Uh, this is information you can obtain from our own government. And uh, basically, uh, this story here, Black Pepper and its Pungent Principal Piperine, a review of diverse physiological effects. Um, I don't need to read all of this. Just go to Google, put in piperine, USNIH, you'll pull up all these different articles yourself. I just wanted to highlight some of the things that are in here. Um, it says, uh, the most far-reaching attribute of piperine has been its inhibitory influence on en enzymatic drug biotransforming reactions in the liver, uh, basically meaning that um, it's helping the liver to process this stuff faster and get it into the bloodstream. Uh, it strongly inhibits hepatic and intestinal and hydrocarbon hydroxylase and UDP glucuronal transferase. I know some of this is techno jargon that I can't even pronounce some of these words properly, but anyway, to make a long story short, piperine has been documented to enhance the bioavailability of a number of therapeutic drugs as well as phytochemicals by this property. Piperine's bioavailability enhancing properties also partly attributed to increased absorption as a result of its effect on the ultrastructure of intestinal brush border. Uh, although initially there were a few controversial reports regarding its safety as a food additive, such evidence has been questionable, and later studies have established the safety of black pepper or its active principle, piperine, in several animal studies. Piperine, while it is non-genotoxic, has in fact been found to possess anti-mutagenic and anti-tumor influences. So that's one. Um, this, this study here, Influence of Piperine on the Pharmacokinetics of Curcumin in Animals and Human Volunteers, uh, basically they're showing uh, by uh, mixing um, piperine with turmeric or curcumin, um, it drastically increased the bioavailability. Um, in fact, in this other study here, uh, another U.S. NIH study, says recent developments in delivery, bioavailability, absorption, and metabolism of curcumin. Uh, you can read the abstract, you know, curcumin is a yellow pigment present in the spice turmeric that has been associated with antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, anti-cancer, antiviral, and antibacterial activities as indicated by over 6,000 citations. It's one of the most widely studied uh, spices or herbs or phytonutrients that you can find in the world. It's, it's incredible. In fact, it's something I personally believe everybody should be taking every day. Uh, in addition, over 100 clinical studies have been carried out with curcumin. Uh, but here's the key. One of the major problems with curcumin is perceived to be the, bioavailabil the bioavailability, how curcumin should be delivered in vivo, how bioavailable it is, how well curcumin is absorbed, and how it is metabolized is the focus of this review. So you go down to uh, point number six here, piperine. Okay, and this is what is astounding. Addition to Adding piperine to turmeric increased the bioavailability by 2,000% after just 45 minutes. That's 2,000%. If you're taking a turmeric supplement 
and it doesn't say that it has piperine with it, you might as well not even bother taking it. It's not going to do the job for you. Okay, so uh, the, this effect of piperine on the pharmacokinetics of curcumin has been shown to be much greater in humans than in rats. So it's even better absorption and more bioavailability when humans use it than rats. In humans, a bio, uh, it was increased 2,000%. Uh, whereas in rats, it has been found that concomitant administration of piperine, 20 milligrams of curcumin, uh, increased the serum concentration of curcumin by 154% for a short period of one to two hours. This study shows that in the dosages used, piperine enhances the serum concentration, extent of absorption, and bioavailability of curcumin in both rats and humans with no adverse side effects. Again, you can go to the USNIH, you can pull up all these studies. You can find all these links, the easiest ways just to go to Google. Um, and we sell a phenomenal turmeric supplement under our Seven Lights brand. Okay, and here's the supplement facts on it. Okay, one capsule has turmeric root, 450 milligrams, extracts, 95% curcuminoids, along with black pepper fruit extract, which is piperine, 5 milligrams. Um, I would highly recommend that you take uh, one to three capsules, probably twice a day, um, and this is going to be one of the best additions that you can put into your diet. Um, a phenomenal antioxidant, a phenomenal anti-inflammatory uh, spice that's needed, and look up inflammation on the internet. You'll find out that inflammation is linked to a, a host of different health problems, so um, I highly encourage you to uh, take advantage of this. Hopefully this information will help you. I appreciate you listening. Thank you.